With the increase in drug use, especially among young people, it's more important than ever to be aware of things going on around you. This is something that's come up from parents very recently. What's being hidden in front of you right in plain sight? Hi, I'm Tom Fulmer with National Drug Screening. And one of the things that we do get is for calls from time to time from parents wanting to find out if their children have been taking any kind of drugs. And so a topic that comes up is if they're taking drugs, how is the parent not aware of that? How are they not observing that? So one is observing signs and symptoms and being able to recognize those. And we do offer some training programs to help you do that. But another very simple technique is to just observe things that are around the house in everyday use. These are just a few items that we picked up just off of Amazon, but they can be secured pretty much anywhere. There's head shops, vape, shop, vape shops, and lots of places online where you can hide these things such as the magic marker. This is actually a real working magic marker. It smells right. If I had a piece of paper, you could see me writing on it right now. However, if you open the back of this magic marker, all of a sudden you have a pipe and you have a little vial to hide some type of whatever it is you wanna hide. Now you ask, well, how do they get away with selling things like this? Well, because this is used to hide your valuables. And that very well could be the case. Why you would need a pipe and a little bottle to hide your valuables, I don't know. And it also comes with a handy dandy smell proof pouch to keep anything being smelled. So in case you think people are gonna smell diamond earrings or hundred dollar bills, you don't want that to happen. Now there's other things too that are just innocuous things. Body spray is a very popular item these days. Feels just like the normal weight, the same function, screw top and all. However, when you open it up, again, a place to store valuables or to store other things. This is something you can find out very easily whether the top screws off or not. Obviously it's not supposed to do so. And again, this comes with the handy smell proof pouch as well. Uh, one of the, the most prevalent things out there is alcohol. Um, alcohol, uh, marijuana is obviously catching up very much too, but alcohol is very, uh, very much uh, one of the top leaders. You have the water bottles. There's a few different variations of these. So it's actual, could have actual water in it in the top. However, you take a little twist and a turn and now you have either a stash compartment. They also have uh, one they've made into that has a screw top that you can put liquid in the bottom. So like vodka, something that wouldn't show up. And then when you're drinking, you could drink water out of here, open it up and have vodka there. And unless you know what you're looking for, you're not gonna notice it. The other simple things, these have been around for a long time, are the hairbrush, again with the smell proof pouch, and the handy dandy lighter, that actually lights. I think all my fluid's gone, but you can see. And it has a dual storage compartment under the bottom. Uh, this has been used to store joints, other things along those lines as well. So these are just a few things that you can observe, whether you're a parent or an employer that may be laying around right in plain sight that may be used for something other than their intended purpose. You also have things like liquid wrench, um, you know, any kind of lubricants, uh, out there, there's all kinds of bottles, basically anything that's been made out there, there's pretty much been a knockoff version of that. Uh, last thing that I don't have an example for you here, but that you can look up online anywhere is called a stash hat or stash cap. That's a ball cap that has storage compartments secretly built into it that you wouldn't know exists. So these are just a few things to help you be more aware of what's going on around you and how you can be prepared to handle situations when they come up. So thanks for joining us. Make sure you tune into more videos at www.nationaldrugscreening.com. Visit our blog. There's lots of information and resources to help you. Make sure you subscribe and like below on the video as well. That way we can keep you updated on all the new things that come out. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you on the next video.